with a solid pool game and a smooth golf swing. You would have never thought 70-year-old Wayne Holt has been living with Parkinson's disease for 21 years. He used to be a racquetball player, and uh, I couldn't keep up with the ball any, anymore. So I decided I needed to find a sport where the ball sat still until I hit it. Holt first noticed his Parkinson's symptoms when he was at lunch with a friend. When I lift my drinking glass, my hand just really had a tremor to it. The Parkinsonian tremors are due to too much break, uh, too much break and not enough gas. So when people try to do personal movement, they get shaking because the break is being applied as they're trying to apply the gas. Levodopa has been the gold standard when it comes to treating Parkinson's symptoms. But after several years, efficiency can fade and long-term use may lead to side effects such as dyskinesia, hallucination, delusions, and sleep problems. But researchers are testing a new drug called AP472. This is really different because it's not dopamine replacement therapy. We're targeting this overactive synapse and bringing that gas and brake back into balance. The drug is designed to be given along with levodopa to increase its effectiveness and limit negative side effects. For Holt, who suffers with dyskinesia, a drug like this can be a game changer. And the more we can do, the more likely we are to cure this thing. I'm Marty Salt reporting.